What is up guys? Welcome back to the video. So today I'm playing Macrom and I'm gonna get up a hundred plus temples, but they are not going to be normal temples. They're going to be modded Ray of Doom temples. Now, if you haven't seen this before, I have done a video on the Ray of Doom temple on my channel before. But today, we're literally going to be getting a hundred plus of them. And oh my god, look at that tower on his side right there. That is insane. Also, it already lagged my game. Okay, that is not a good sign. But let me get this tower. Now, this is not a normal tag shooter. This is like a kind of goo shooter and it does insane damage. Now, I really need to farm hard because as you can see, the rounds go faster than normal. So if I want to get up 100 plus temples, I have to get up 100 plus super monkeys. And yeah, that is not going to be easy. But yeah, I really hope you guys do enjoy this video. Definitely stay tuned because this is going to be absolutely insane in getting every single temple up and seeing if we can beat Macrom. Now, he's going to have some super duper powerful. Oh my God, did I just have a voice crack? So he's going to have some super duper powerful modded towers over there versus my 100 plus Ray of Dooms. Now, I should probably get some upgrades on this goo shooter right here because, oh, yeah, we, we don't want to die to the AI. That would be terrible. Also, have you seen how much he is farming over there? My God, he is farming insanely hard. Okay, let me just get up a ton of Republics because if we mega boost all of these Republics, well, you know exactly what's going to happen. It's going to be insane. We're going to have so many factories that are going to be boosted to insane amounts of levels. Are we okay against the AI, by the way? Because I do believe these balloons look way harder than normal. Yeah. So, also, there are bad balloons. As you can see right here, there are bad balloons. There are DDTs. Like, stuff in this mod is absolutely broken. Okay, I just tower mega boosted. Um, We definitely need to get explosive glue. Look at that. It looks so awesome. And look at the tower on his side as well. They're like, they're kind of seeking weird magic bolts. Which, honestly, they look seriously cool. Okay, let me just get all of the expensive banana upgrades on all of these factories and honestly you know what i think we are done i think we're done with the farming like this is so many farms let me just start getting up these super monkeys now it's gonna take a while to get up every single super monkey hopefully i end up with 100 plus although maybe it won't quite be that it'll probably be like around 90 to 100 uh but hopefully we do manage to get the 100 i know it is possible on this map this map has an insane amount of space for putting stuff down like look at this look how many super monkeys i can put down now, hopefully, my Ray of Doom temples are strong enough late game to, like, go super late. Because I know Babaloons and DDTs, like, they are really hard to kill late game. And unless you have, like, a really good late game tower, you won't be able to defend against them. But I'm hoping with all of these Ray of Doom temples, uh, we'll be good to go. So, let's just keep on getting these super monkeys up. Now, one problem is, do I have a camera detection? And the answer is, well, I don't know. Like, does the goo shooter have camera detection? It seems like it shoots out, like, wait, let me just get this one. Goo puddles, what does this do? After the goo explodes, it leaves a puddle of goo on the track. Uh, okay, and we'll get compressed glue as well. Like, I don't know. I don't know what the... Oh, he's using a mega boost right there. Oh, my God. He has... Wait, what is happening on his side? He has fireballs raining down from the heavens right there. That is so cool. I'm going to give it a thumbs up. Now, I have a four-tier tower on my side, right? I'm not going to get any fifth tiers. Actually, I don't even have any fifth tiers, so that's absolutely fine because I'm pretty sure it will crash the game. But yeah, let's keep on getting these up. I can't wait until the moment where we mega boost all of these to 100 plus temples. Like, it is going to be so, so fun. Okay, I really hope I get 100 plus as well. Like, it's going to take a while to get these up. We're actually doing a pretty fast job, though. Uh, I'm also, I've got the ninja. Wait, wait, look at the towers on his side. Look at the wizard right there. That's so cool. Can you see that? Look, it's like Phoenix Wings or something. That is amazing. Okay, wait. How many is... I, I'm pretty sure I have a lot of Super Monkeys on my side right now. I just need to get rid of a couple of these farms. Wait, what I'm going to do is... I'm going to get rid of all of these farms... But I'm going to get them to uh, the uh, the BIA because that way I can actually make a lot of eco, which I really need on these early rounds, although I've kind of missed my chance, sort of. So let's just quickly get up a bunch of BIAs. Let's also just sell these factories. Let's keep on getting these soup monkeys and hopefully I will have 100 plus. But yeah, his side right there. It's ridiculous. He has ice falling from the sky. He has fireballs falling from the sky. He also has those weird phoenix wings uh, on that summon phoenix. And he also has a regular phoenix as well. Okay, I really... I genuinely, I have no idea what's happening on his side. Also, I do know that DDTs will be coming out fairly soon. So we really need to make sure we have at least plasma on all of these super monkeys. And it's kind of a pain, to be honest, to get up every single one to plasma. But you know what? It, it's what we have to do to get all of these temples up. And I really need to do it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. He has the dartling gun right there. He has the dartling gun. Now, the Ray of Doom, the modded Ray of Doom in this mod is actually insane. Like, uh, trust me, you guys will want to see it. It's not like the normal one. Also, 
Look at that. Can you see that tiny missile right there? It looks like it's not going to do anything cool, right? Wow, you're wrong. You are dead wrong because look at that. It actually spawns like mini like temple plasma and stuff and it does an insane amount of damage. Okay, wait, are we doing okay on our side right here? I know we do have the goo shooter, but I'm a bit scared because these rounds, they get really hard really quickly. But I mean, we have spawned a lot of these towers already. Like we have literally filled the whole map with super monkeys. If I don't have 100 plus, I don't know how you can get 100 plus because I have been filling the map nonstop. Now, super monkeys, they do take up quite a lot of space on the map. I mean, you can count it, guys, in the comment section if you really want to. But we've pretty much got 100 Super Monkeys here. We've definitely got a lot of them. Now, are there any other spaces where, yep, there's a space right there. Probably, could, if I had fit them a tiny bit better, probably could have fit more. But it's okay. Now, what we have to do is we have to use the Plasma. We have to get the Plasma upgrades. And then, when we got every single Super Monkey to Plasma, what we're going to do is we're going to Mega Boost it. And, yep, the whole side is going to be Sun Gods. And then, if we Mega Boost it one more time... The whole side will be the Ray of Doom Temples. Now, it is a super powerful upgrade, so I'm pretty sure we're going to be able to get to at least round 80. Now, obviously, this mod, like, it does make the balloons harder. Like, normally, you don't have bads and stuff on your side. Also, I, I apologize if I miss any of these plasmas. It's Honestly, it's kind of hard to see. As you can see, my side is insanely ridiculous right now. Like, look at this. We have so many Super Monkeys still unupgraded, and I've literally been doing this as fast as possible. Yeah, obviously, you can't see if some of them are upgraded or not also look at his side right there he is getting so many of those dartling guns and i'm honestly surprised he hasn't been getting the ray of doom because i thought the modded ray of doom was the best one to go for but i mean you do you but yeah it's it never it's never not fun just to fill a whole map with super monkeys to go late game but it's so much better when you've literally, you can mega boost everything to Ray of Doom Temples, which is something that obviously you can't get in the normal game. Now, I don't have to get the uh, the range upgrades for all of these super monkeys, because actually, um, the Ray of Doom Temple has infinite range, and I accidentally just got one of those. Okay, that was a bit stupid. Let's sell that, otherwise that will literally sacrifice all of my hard work. Okay, there we go. Couple more. I think we're done, guys. I think every single one has been upgraded, guys. Oh my god. Okay, well... I guess let's just go for it. Let's do the first Mega Boost right here. Now, as you can see, we have a lot of Sun Gods on our side right here. He is doing a really good job over there of defending. I feel like he does need to go for the Ray of Dooms, though. Otherwise, he literally might die because that is a lot of stuff on his side right there. Like, it's not too hard right now. But look, we're only seven minutes in. And oh my god, look at everything. Like, this is not normal. Like, we are only seven minutes in. We are on round 39. You, you would not normally be on that round. Also, we've almost got the Mega Boost, guys. We've almost got the Mega Boost. I'm using it right now. Let's go. Oh my god, look at my side right now. Look at my side. Okay, so obviously, this is the Ray of Doom Temple. As you can see, infinite wrap range. If I just click on them or hover over them, every single one over here is attacking the balloons. Oh my god, is he going to be okay? That defense is good, but I, I don't know if he's going to be able to defend, like, ultra late game. Like, I don't know if he's going to be able to defend ultra late game. He is literally, he is going to struggle a lot, guys. He is going to struggle a lot. But we're eight minutes in. I've got all of my Ray of Doom temples, and I literally, I cannot see the balloons on my side. I can't see any balloons on my side, and we are on round 42. So, okay, the, the bad balloons are going to come out quick. Oh, my God. There is a ZMG right there. Wait, 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 wait. We popped it instantly. I did not even get to see the ZMG on my side. Like, we popped it so quickly. Now, his defense is actually doing a pretty good job against all these ZMGs and stuff. Like, I'm actually surprised. These, these modded bads or whatever, he's selling, he's finally selling his farms to fill the space with even more of them. But they seem to do it like a really decent amount of damage over there. Now, is he going to go for the Ray of Dooms? Oh, there we go. There it's the Ray of Doom. Look at that. It also, it changes color. Just look at that. It's so pretty. Obviously, it's three times as powerful as the regular Ray of Doom. So, yeah, I, I don't think he's going to be dying anytime soon. We're nine minutes in, round 49. We have yet to see any DDTs or bad balloons, but they will be coming out soon for sure. But, yeah, so he's filled one side of the map with the bads, the modded bads. Oh, oh, my God, there are the DDTs. Did you see them? But on my side, wait, look at the bad. Look how quickly I popped it. No way, that's broken. That's actually broken. Did you see how quickly I killed that bat? Now, he is killing it fairly quickly. I mean, his side looks amazing with the multicolored Ray of Dooms and also the bad upgrades. And also that random summon Phoenix in the middle with the Phoenix wings. Like, it looks really, really cool. I am obviously doing a much a better job at the moment. Uh, however, 
if he gets if he fills the whole map with the ray of dooms i feel like he's gonna be doing a better job than me uh because actually wait 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 my temple spawns how many five rays of doom and his ray of doom tower spawns three ray of dooms now if the damage is same the same for both of them then i i feel like i should be doing better uh because obviously you can probably fit a couple more darklings on the map than the super monkey but I feel like I should definitely be doing a better job right here. We're around 56 right now. We've already seen the Babylon. We've seen the DDTs. We're not really struggling to anything. Like, we are going insanely late game, guys. This is... We might actually get to around 100. Like, I, I don't see why not. I, I really don't see why not. And we also have the Ninja, which means we can get the Sabotage supply lines up somewhere. If I can find a space for it, I'm pretty sure there's... Yep, there's space over here, dude. There is space over here. Let's get the Sabo right there so we can slow things down to half speed, even though our defense is completely broken. So that's obviously kind of unfair. That's that's pretty unfair. We got two Sabos up already. Uh, let's go for some more Sabos if we can find space. Uh, there was definitely a space right there. Yep. Yeah three sabos he is doing a good job of defending over there but i am doing a way better job these ray of doom temples they are too good they are actually too good they are broken dude they are doing so much damage to literally everything on my side look how many zmgs right there are right there and remember they're around at 63 now around 64 zmgs so they're way faster than usual they also have more health than usual but we're not struggling we are not struggling at all. And this isn't even balloon circles. This is not the longest map in the game. This is a pretty short map. It's like, basically, it's the definition of, like, a medium map. But we are really, like, we are killing them instantly still. Round 66. Now, he is still doing a good job over there. Oh, my God. This just looks insane. This late game is so fun, dude. We're almost to round 69. Are we going to be able to get to round 100? I honestly think we are going to be able to get to round 100. I mean, our side, yes. We would be able to get to around 100. His side, I don't know. I don't know if his side is good enough to get to around 100. Around 69 right now. When have you seen anyone get to around this high before on YouTube in a video? I mean, obviously, it's modern and stuff. But people just don't go this late game anymore in videos. But obviously, we are going late game. We are already on round 71 probably right here. Yep, round 71. We are popping everything. Literally, it's just so easy. It is so easy. Oh, wait. Also, can you see only one of the temples actually has the blade shoot? Shooting out uh, because that's that's because we sacrificed the goose shooter wait can i actually fit the goose shooter somewhere like i feel like that would actually be really cool i i there's definitely probably a space on my map i can't see it though and you can definitely see the zmgs are getting further on my side they're getting further and further every single round um but still they have literally they have not got past the first bend right here dude we're 13 minutes in and we're already on round 74 this is way later than I expected. I didn't think we'd actually get to around 100, but his defense does actually seem like it may be good enough. Also, there is definitely a space right there. Let's get all of these go. Oh, electrical overcharge. Okay, I'm just going to get this because I can. It looks really awesome, and I feel like we need... I mean, we don't really need the extra damage, right? Uh, but you can already see. Look at his pop count. Look at his pop count. It's already going up insanely fast. Like, some of these Ray of Doom temples, they literally have... Okay, 22 pops. 37 pops like they are not getting the pops but this thing for some reason is getting all of the balloon pops which i really like unfortunately though we don't have an ability for it the only ability we have is the sabo which is pretty cool okay i'm gonna sell it wait how much money do we have Three hundred fifty-three thousand. we have less money than i thought uh because as you can see a bad a bad costs seventy-five thousand dollars to send one if we wanted to send a bad to him and obviously, we don't really want to do that yet because we want to get to around 100. And honestly, I'm starting to think that is going to happen because our defense, look, they're still, they're not getting past the first bend. And on his side, they are getting past the first bend, the first two bends, but they're not even halfway through the map. Like, this is insane at game. I haven't gone this late in, like, a year, probably. Um, so, I'm going to send him the heart, my, heart tires. Remember, I'll link his channel in the description of this video. He actually made this mod. He's a really awesome modder. And thank you so much for playing me and just helping out with the videos and stuff. I really appreciate it. Yeah, these rounds are modded to go around uh, faster. So, we're already around 83, 14 minutes in. Normally, it would take, like, 40 minutes to get to this round if you were doing a regular late game. So, it's just really nice that this mod just makes it easier to go late game i really do appreciate that dude we have literally had this same defense for absolutely ages 
And like, Wizard definitely carried him early game. Like the Wizard he had with the Phoenix Wings. It allowed him to farm and get up all these Darling Guns. And I do feel like the Race of Doom are a bit better on his side. I don't feel like the, the Golden Dart and the Golden Little Temple Ball thing is really doing that much damage to all of the Mario class moves. Okay, it is definitely getting further on his side right now. I mean, there was a time, well, so there was a time where, like, on my side, you couldn't even see the ZOMGs. But now, you can really see them every single round. Getting really far on my side. Dude, we're actually going to be able to get to around 100. We are actually going to get to around 100. That's insane. I did not think that was possible. If he doesn't die, that is. If he doesn't die. Because it is getting pretty damn close on his side right here. I mean, he's doing really good damage to the ZOMGs. But they have a lot of health. They have an absolute ton of health. And they're getting closer and closer every single time. Dude, 10 more rounds. We just have to go 10 more rounds of this. And then we'll get to around 100. And we'll be able to do this. Oh my god. Round 91, nine rounds away. I did not expect us to go this late game. This is actually unbelievable. And these Ray of Doom Temples, they are working overtime right now to defend against everything. And I, I think we're going to be able to do it. Unless Makrom like chokes, which oh, actually it's not really choking. Uh, if he like aimed all of his Dartling Guns not at the balloons, he would probably die. But yeah, look, okay, on round 100, I'm going to rush. I'm going to rush with a bunch of bad balloons and we're going to see what happens. Because I... I don't think he's going to be able to defend against Babylon. Like, we have not seen it. It's literally just been ZOMGs. Like, we have not seen any Babylons. Maybe around 100, he sends, like, a Babylon and stuff. But unless that happens, I don't think he's going to tie. But, yeah, we're going to send the Babylon five more rounds. We're around 95 right now. This is insane. Okay, I should probably get that tag shooter back. Because, honestly, actually, I don't really know how much. Actually, no, we can't. We can't because then we won't have enough money to rush him and stuff. I'm really surprised the game hasn't crashed yet, though. Like, seriously, how has the game not crashed yet? It's insane. Wait, he's gonna die! Oh my god, it's getting so close. Okay, he just managed to defend against that. Dude, it is getting way too close on his map. And you can see, okay, he is still aiming the Dartling Guns. I was a bit worried that he wasn't aiming them. He is still aiming them. Round 98. Round 98 already. That is ridiculous. That's a ridiculous number. I don't think I've ever got to round 100. I mean, yes, it is a mod, of course. But still, it's round 100 nonetheless. Okay, round 99. I'm giving him the thumbs up. Wait, no, don't give him the thumbs down. There is the thumbs up. Let's send the Babylon as soon as round 100 starts. Oh my god, round 100. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my god, let's send it. Let's send the Babylon. I just sent a Babylon to him on around 100. Is he going to be able to... Wait, wait, wait. Is he actually able to defend against that? Wait, where did it go? Where did the Babylon go? Okay, I just sent a bunch. There we go. Oh, wait. They're popping instantly. Why are they popping? Oh, my God. That's... Wait, what? Did you see? Oh, my God. They barely did anything. Why did they not... Okay. Apparently, ZOMGs are stronger than Babylons right now. He's spamming his Red Hot Road Spikes. We're on round 102 right now. Oh, wait, we can mega boost BFBs. I'm so dumb. I am so dumb. Okay, how much can we sell these for? Okay, I'm going to sell. I'm just going to sell a ton of these. I'm just going to sell a ton. Okay, there is our money. Now we mega boost. Oh, my God. Wait, please don't crash. Oh, my God. What is happening? What is happening right now? Why is it being weird? Okay, mega boost BFBs. I just... Oh, my God. Look how many BFBs are on his side. Look at that. Look at that. That's insane. I just sent so many... Oh, there's no way he's going to be able to defend against that, guys. No way. He is dead. He is going down to my rush, guys. On round 105. Wait, how is he still alive? No, he's dead. Okay. Guys, I really hope you guys enjoyed that video. Make sure to like, watch another video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.